Alright, what is up guys? As always, welcome back to another, well, OU game, really. Do we see Dragovich, so OU-ish. And really, we see a rain team with um, very, very frightening stuff. Um, wow, I mean, Pelipper is just very rough. Um, <clears throat> most spawns here are kind of rough, aren't they? Um, this is, yeah, this is kind of kind of up there. I mean, I have sentry on to kind of deal with them. Um, kind of send off arrows to begin with. Um, I have, in theory, and can't speak, uh, arrows to kind of gauge the team. And I think that will work well in my favor. I don't deal well with Pelipper, then again, who does? And I think Pelipper is the lead with U-turn, so my intention here is to actually uh, um, teleport on his U-turn. That's my whole plan. So, Frank, good luck, have fun. Um, I mean, he said it was monotype, so, you know, I'll, I'll give him a benefit of a doubt. Becky Pan. Great nickname. I think that's the Japanese name of Pelippa. So, you can two, do two ways against me, besides setting out Drizzle. But you could either go for a Hurricane, which won't do too much, unless it gets me confused. Um, but most likely, and I think the right play here is just you turn out. So, um, I get some chip that I most likely will get, I will get back. And... Um, We'll see what he decides to bring in. What would I bring in? I feel... Berescuta is kinda nice. Let's see. Hatsuka, yeah, that, that's a Berescuta. Hey! Here I am! That said though, it's not like I have a natural switch into this, it's just... Um, it's a response. That's all it is. Um, I mean, mailman do take whatever he throws at me. There is no way I have something like air lace and whatnot. So, dynamic punch here. I think Pelipper or Jarados comes in. Would be nice to have Thunder Punch here. Won't deny that. But all of him, I definitely switch out. Plus two will give me nothing more but pain in speed. Where if I connect a dynamic punch, then I get something confused, which is really helpful. Yeah, he withdraws, I get that. Pelipper or Jarados? I can do pecs. Dynamic punch, do connect it, which is, I guess, great-ish. Don't be Rocky Helmet, please. And he is Black Sludge. So a skull is kinda... Kinda self-explanatory. So we're gonna send his sentry on basically to... Uh, get the mist train up so he can't burn me or toxic me or whatever. You're just painful bunker here, I guess. Let's see... Confused, but we will see target spikes. So, yeah, well, unfortunate. I guess that's all right. Thing is, do I want to default on this? I think a nature madness here, actually. Just to see what it wants to do. I hate rain teams. <laughs> well, I like them, but uh, damn, are they rough. Bit surprised, by the way, he decides to go for Toxic Spike since I could have you or the obvious move. Let's see. Painful Bunker, that's fair. I was like thinking, how does he have priority? So, Nature's Madness. Defogging here. So it could have scald, I'm sure, and maybe recover. Damn, 
Damn, he gets all the confused turns. Poison jab. So, he had a physical move. And now I can't get poisoned. <laughs> I was like, don't say that. Gonna screw yourself over. Alright. <clears throat> so this is kind of good. Um, I'm gonna go for full powered... Because I think I'm going to Toxic Spike again, or Poison Jab. And I think this scares him out. Rather safely, actually. He really was confused for quite some time. So, I could either Bone Ryan kill him, but since he has two floaters, I think it would be a mistake for me of... Uh, not just going for a very safe knockoff. Disrupted Quagsire. Yeah, like, you switch out here. Liviature. It feels like a Gyarados. Feels that is a Gyarados. This knockoff still gonna do a fair chunk. Yeah, yeah, I did alright. Choice band. Yeah, I'm not taking any damage here, aren't I? Um Water boosted. Yep, sending our class trying to take um, Waterfall. Don't know how this is gonna go at all. <laughs> Don't die! Jesus Christ, yeah. We didn't die though. <laughs> uh. So now it comes to Quagsire. Right. Gotta attack though. I mean, any damage on this is great. Because, like I said, Quagsire is such an easy switch in. And it would be just be great to get something onto it. If I connect it, which I don't. So that's the name of the game, I should just have switched out. Um. But these things usually just go for Toxics and whatnot, so we're sending in Centrion. Um, usually combination, if I'm lucky, is um, just Toxic or Skull together with... Um, well, whatever tickle his fancy, really. Let's see, Skull, as fair. Won't do anything, then again, he can't do anything to me besides recovering back and forth. Um, which will work for me. Just go for a very safe Nature's Madness here. So you want to throw at me. Like I said, you can just recover through this. Toxic. Nope. Protected by the mist, boy. Protected by the mist. Or, it's, it's subjective, but yeah, protected. So, he should be able to recover through this. So what I'm going to do is actually throw myself a soul stance, possibly two, depending on what he decides to do. Because he clearly stays in to recover. No, oh, he's, damn it, two. It's not the worst. I just, I don't think I can beat it. Go for a soul stance here, see how much we can stomach here. Nice. Nice. That gives me a second win for another soul stance. We got the unburden, but... Don't know how much that will help. Painful bunker. No problem. No problem. It's alright. Go for an earthquake here. See what it wants to do. 
Leaf Blade would probably be safer, but... Um, or a Soul Sand would have been safer, but right now I am a pretty nice situation here. Right, stays in. I think we should knock it out. Even though it's a Sceptile. Yeah, yeah, it worked. <sighs> Alright, Sceptile. I'm burden, but you are, all things said, and really, really, really all things said, you are unfortunately, I really mean this when I say it, adamant, so you can't outspeed the Beresguda, if yes. <sighs> That's the rough part. I can't outspeed Beresguda if it is, um, damn it. If it's Jolly, then that won't work. I still have responses left, but uh, I could have been more solid. Here is the drizzle. Come on, Septal, come on. Make this work. Thing is, he can just sack play through this. I think he decided not to. Oh, and he lives. God damn it. Oh, but it's Air Slash. Yes! I'm plus one, baby. I am plus one. And I wasted one of your precious turns. Now, had it been, damn it, like, had it been Hurricane, that would have been a kill. And had I saw stance one more time, it would have been a kill. It's so, alright, he decided not to. Huh. To Dracovish. So, is this a sack play, I guess? Because this is gonna kill him. No? Just wasting turns. I'm wasting all the rain I can. Pukki pan, pukki pan, pukki pan. Septile, whatever is happening here, it has all already proven its merits, and I'm quite happy how it has turned about. But it is all about the Berescuda. And like I said, if it's jolly, then there is nothing I can do. Leaf Blade and hope for the best. Don't be jolly! It's very jolly! And that's gonna kill. That's it, boys. That's it. Damn shame! To an extent. But I can always send in the mailman. I can get my blunder support. I want the blunder support. Badly. I'm getting myself poisoned. Which will not be helpful. But yeah, dynamic punch. Basically, I wanna force his quag to come in and we'll see what happens through there. Whatever happens, like my Sceptile did, way more than it should have done, and I'm happy. Sceptile was an absolute threat for him. Oh, he is thinking. I've yet to show that I'm blunder support, and um, it could be problematic. I need a plus two for Pelipper. With Ross, which I think is fair, goes to Bakipon. Which is absolutely a sack place. I really hope I miss. Fuck me. <laughs> but we won't reset. I need like great two. Oh, damn it. Gonna get my beast boost. And some poison to that. So, depending on what he wants to do, I outspeed the Quagsire. <laughs> but I think a well placed waterfall kills me. Liquidation, even. Oh, damn it. Oh, did stomach it though. Mailman, miss! Yes! Now I just hope the rain is over, because if not, then that was an absolute waste. Please tell me the rain is over. <laughs> Fuck me. <laughs> Maybe I should just attack him. <laughs> what? Why did I do that? That was dumb. That was very dumb, actually. So I have every reason to think he is uh just gonna drain kiss here. Um 
I have a reason to think he's banded. Banded or scarfed. Or you even sashed. But I should stomach any hit they can throw at me. Just the poison will eat me away. But draining kiss should do really nothing significant. Why didn't I attack? I feel so silly now. I clearly would have stomach any hit it can throw at me. I knew that. <laughs> but basically, once the rain is over, I should be able with Marowak to kind of pop the Quagsire. Though not risk free. He's thinking about this, which I absolutely appreciate. Yeah, he, he has to be locked into that. We stomach that quite alright. Raining Kiss will do. Definitely less than I thought it would do. But every recovery is a good recovery. And now he won't get any boost. Which is good for me. I like that this is a matchup he can't beat. Even with the poison, he can't beat it. However, Quagsire looks to be very, very tough. So we're draining Kiss again. If we switch in Quagsire, I think we're going to recover a good chunk. It's one of those stalemates. I really want to break through, but I just I can't do it. But Burst Gouda should outspeed Thunderous too. So Thunderous is a natural sack play. Oh, he Dynamaxed. Oh, buddy, 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 buddy. That's not fair. That is not fair, buddy. Alright, let's see how much we we'll recover. But basically... Ah... Uh, Damn it. Max Geisha. This sign won't do too much to me. But the next one will definitely do a lot more. <sighs> it surely did. Running Kids does. Nothing worth writing home about. You know, roughly the same. That was not nice, buddy. I can take another one of those, for sure. But I have nothing to respond with. So we do this, Max God. It's whether or not I want to go for my Max Fairy move, or... Ah, oh, damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. I could either go for my Max Fairy move, which I think... Oh! No! You coward! You knew I won, didn't you? You son of a bitch. Ah, oh, such a shame! Such a shame! Such a shame, buddy! Couldn't take the loss, could you? <laughs> well, that will actually wrap up our week of Sceptile. I really hope you guys enjoyed this. And, um, yeah, I had a lot of fun with it. It was a dumb team, and I definitely enjoyed it. And, ah, uh, uh, I'm disappointed. So anyway, guys, um, next week will be Absol, and um, this is the last game we record. It's our first day before New Year. Hopefully, we get something going with that. So with that, so guys, as always, thank you for watching, and have a great day, everyone. Take care.